when you are growing plants indoors and you are farming vertically, then uh, LED light is one of the most important aspects of your farm. Having the proper LED lighting is essential because you want to reduce your energy consumption as much, much as you possibly can, but you also want the light to last as much as possible. This is an uh, Indo light that made the uh, VertiLink, it's called. The, it's 29 watt lights and then we have these lights, they're high quality, they are really, really solid. And then we have four lights in a kit, so this kit matches perfectly the trolley systems that we also have on the shop. You are probably wondering what LED light makes sense to use, what's good, what's not. And it's really a jungle out there because there's so many companies all saying they have the best light in the world. So our thought is we take the different LED lights that we have on the shop and then we start making tests with them. We start growing uh, different herbs underneath these lights and then we see how fast can we grow them, how much will the yield be and how much what have we used on this. So in this way you're going to learn a lot about the lights because lights is very important. If you don't have the proper spectrum, for example, then you will not get the, the growth that you are looking for. Um, if you have a light with a lot of green and a lot of yellow, for example, that's colors that the plant doesn't respond to very well. It needs to be either red or blue. So the, the, the red primarily and the blue is what is making photosynthesis in the plant happen. So if you have green or you have yellow light, a lot of it in a white light, for example, then you are losing a lot of efficiency. But it's difficult to know when you're not an expert on the light. And I want to help you become smarter with the lights. So that's why we may, we're gonna make these tests. We don't know yet if we're gonna make them on the trolley or we are going to make them in a tent. We will see that. But yeah, follow the, subscribe to the channel if you wanna see how these light tests go because I'm really excited about it. And I'm very curious about how this is going to measure up against the other lights that we have. So, if you want to start growing plants indoors in a small setup like this, then we have everything you need on nordichydro.com. Then you can start growing microgreens or herbs, salads, flowers, strawberries, everything that you create. It's your creativity that is putting a toll on what's possible or not. But yeah, this is very, really cool and I'm really excited to show you guys this. Hopefully you learned something in this video. Hopefully you're gonna learn more about lights in the future from us. So subscribe to the channel. And if you, if you already are a subscriber, I salute you. Thank you for being here. See you in the next one.